every day. Like, what's our anchors today? Hello, Sequoia Junior. Hi, happy birthday. Hello, Sequoia Junior. Hi, happy birthday. Is that cool? Yep. Yeah. I know we have. Hello, Sycamore Junior High. Today is Wednesday, May 25th, 2022. Welcome to this episode of our daily video announcements, and a special mention to share our thoughts and prayers for the families of Rob Elementary. I'm Cassie. Hello all, happy Wednesday. We're down to only seven more days of school and only five more video announcement episodes. And yes, we share our thoughts and prayers. I'm Nikolai. Now let's stand placing our right hand over our heart to say the Pledge of Allegiance as a community together. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America Thank you, and please be seated. Remember, for your Memorial Day weekend red, white, and blue wear this Friday, May 27th, to recognize all of those who served and lost their lives defending our free United States of America. Everyone remember to complete the Fun of Fun survey in the News Crew Communications Classroom now. The survey will remain open until the end of this week of the week. Special thanks to Nikolai and Ollie for the News Crew Top 10 project this year, and Sophia and Cece's fun intros. Now, what's the National Day choice today? Today is National No Plastic Day. International Plastic Free Day is a call to action and brings attention to the plastic we use every day. On May 25th, commit to using no single-use plastic for one day, including bottles, take-out food containers, utensils, bags, and wrappers. Over 380 million tons of plastic is produced every year. Half of all plastic produced is single use, meaning it's thrown away after just one use. Since only 9% of all plastic gets recycled, most of it ends up withering our communities, filling our landfills, and polluting our oceans. International Plastic Free Day creates awareness of just how much plastic we use every day and how we can use less of it. Consider all the ways single use plastic is used in our daily lives. Bottles, cleaning products, to-go containers, food packaging, Cups, straws, lids, storage bags, and product packaging. Now for the fact of the day. Did you know that according to ESPN, the hardest sport in the world is boxing, with a difficulty rating of 72.375. Some close runner-ups are ice hockey with a rating of 71.75, and American football with a score of 68.375. Again. Remember to complete the Funathon survey. Your input matters in decision making. This, this survey will stay up until Friday, May 27th. The results from yesterday's survey. It asks if you would rather have a longer lunch or a longer recess. And the majority of you have picked a lunch. I would definitely agree. Also, make sure to check out the daily survey on our Google Classroom. Next up, birthdays. Happy birthday to Carson E., Grace H., and Gabriel R. We hope you have a wonderful day to celebrate. No news from our wonderful Mr. Harris today, but remember to wear red, white, and blue Friday, check your school email, return your school library books, and finish the school year strong by turning in assignments. Also, please continue to respect each other and treat each other nicely. Be safe, be responsible, be a problem solver, and be respectful. Refer to Hanin and Ava with their special staff recognition segment. Hello, Sycamore Junior High. Welcome back to Hanin and I's second episode of Staff Member of the Week. I'm Ava. And I'm Hanin. This week, we, we would like to recognize Mr. Shomo for his kindness toward his students and good teaching ethics for other staff members to observe. Unfortunately, Mr. Shomo wasn't available to film with us today, but we can, but we can share some of Mr. Shomo's responses to our questions. Mr. Shomo, you were recognized by Sycamore Junior High students for your kindness towards, others, to, towards your students and your calm attitude in the classroom. What advice would you give to your other teachers at Sycamore Junior High to help them make an impact on the student body just like you did? Mr. Shomo said, no advice needed for my colleagues, because they already do an amazing job. Okay. Lastly, as a nominee, Mr. Shomo would like to ask, Mr. Shomo, would you like to ask and or say anything to Sycamore Junior High body for your nomination? His response was, thank you, and I hope the students recognize the hard work put in by all the staff in our, in our building. Again, 
Thanks to Mr. Shomo for your responses, and have a good day, everyone. Keep an eye out for our third and final staff member of the week recognition episode. Go, Go Waves! What is for lunch today? For lunch, we will have the walking taco bar. We will also serve hamburgers and cheeseburgers. Okay, guys, with summer approaching, we know it's getting hard to pay attention in class. But please make sure you carry out this year on a good note. Now for the joke of the day. Why do bees have sticky hair? Why? Because they use honeycombs. <laughs> <laughs> Go, Go Waves! waves.